in the history of Ghana, Nana Arodankwa Kufuado stands out as one of the country's leaders who has transformed the education sector. Yes, from introducing free senior high school to promoting free TV programs and even replacing textbooks with tablets, his vision is clear, education for all. When you mention the name of J.J. Rowling, district assemblies come to mind. When you mention the name of John Ajakum Kufo, National Health Insurance Scheme comes to mind. When you mention another Dankwa Kufuado, Free Senior High School comes to mind. Two years ago, President Akufuado took a bold step by cutting the sword for the construction of Accra STEM Academy. This is not just any school, it is a hub of creativity, critical thinking, and hands on learning from kindergarten all the way to senior high. This academy is part of a bigger vision to create a 21st century learning environment for every Ghanaian child. It is a place where children will learn by doing, preparing them for career in technology, engineering, and beyond, just like what China is doing. Doing. These are skills our children need to thrive in a rapidly changing world. We are beginning what will be the dawn of a new time, a new era in education. The vision of the president is that if we don't transform education, education cannot play its rightful role in transforming the economy. In the fourth industrial revolution, our students should be learning in spaces and learning things that will change their minds for them to transform the country. So the first STEM Academy in Ghana is going to begin today here with the short curtain by His Excellency, the President. His vision that in the fourth industrial revolution for Africa to compete, we need to have the great minds starting from kindergarten focusing on science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. Indeed, our world is essentially driven by technology, energy, industry, agriculture, medicine and health, clean air and water, transportation, sanitation, the use, management and conservation of natural resources. The successful exploitation of all these sectors depends ultimately on the application of science and technology. The time has come for us to reorient our educational system to equip students with the right technological skills needed to succeed in the 21st century. Today, the Vice President of Ghana, Dr. Mahmoud Baumia, visited the Accra STEM Academy to inspect the progress so far.
Accra STEM Academy is not just about academics, it's about equipping young Ghanaians with the confidence to innovate, the curiosity to explore, and the skills to lead. This institution stands as a powerful symbol of what can be achieved when we invest in our future. And that is all for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching. My name is Sheriff Haruna. Have a joyful life and see you in the next one. Macrao. Thank you.